Today I got a new wood stove. It's from Princess Auto. I'm gonna unbox this. So I have a nice shanty in my backyard I like to use when I'm barbecuing. Get in out of the cold. And I have a little, uh, and I have a fireplace in there also from Princess Auto. I thought I'd upgrade to a different one. So we'll unbox that, see how it goes. So we'll unbox this, this is a new stove. And we'll get that set up. Current wood stove that I also got from Princess Auto a few years ago. And I got it in the uh, shanty now. I got a little fire going in there. There's the box. Nice door latch on there. Yeah, here's one of the reasons I wanted to upgrade here. A larger chimney pipe, larger than the diameter of the current chimney, so I'll get better airflow. A spark arrester for the top. Our flange for our chimney. And the hardware to put everything together. So I'm just gonna bolt that flange on put the feet on so I'll see you back in a minute so the flange here has threads in it so it's gonna bolt from the inside of the stove into this so we'll bolt that they're m6 bolts so you need a m5 allen wrench okay because I'm reaching inside the allen wrench is really hard to get through these threads I think they probably treated the threads after they threaded it so it's really tight contact with these bolts so every little turn is a little bit of a challenge so i got a ratchet with five mil bit and uh, i'll put that inside the stove and that way this will never leave the bolt and i just continue and tighten it up so that'll just speed up the process now on to the legs a couple clearance holes there There, this will help me get down in there. Here. There, I got all four legs on. I got my chimney part on there. Let's set this down. Here it is all put together. You can see it's similar in height to my other one there that's in the shanty. This one's a little heavier, I believe. It's got a much heavier door with a gasket around it. Of course, some vent holes there. Okay, let's put some charcoal in here and do a little burn. There we are, first burn. So I'll do a good burn in here, clean everything out. I'll be replacing my one in the shanty with this one. I think I'm gonna benefit from the larger chimney. Get that fire started a little quicker. So the wood stove needed quite a burn off here to get all those, that paint smell and manufacturing smells out of it. I found that there just wasn't quite enough breathing holes in the door to get a nice fire going. So I just propped it open with the scraper here to uh, get that fire going. But once it gets going, it's quite a hot fire. It gives off much more heat than the old stove that I had. So I think I'm really going to be happy with this, especially with the flat top on there. I'll probably get one of those fans that goes on top, circulate the air in here. The gaskets on the door, well, they're just put on with glue and they just fell off, but that's okay because I need a lot of draft through that door anyway. I hope this video helped you out if you're interested in buying one of these stoves from Princess Auto. It really does the job, kicks off the heat, makes it really comfortable in here. 
click that subscribe if you like videos like this and you see what other video I might put out.